Even in a city hailed for its iconic skyline, everything about Dubai's latest unveiling is unlike anything else. From the state-of-the-art technology used to design and build this elliptical curiosity, to what lies within. The Museum of the Future turns the conventional on its head. Its aim, says Mohammed Al Gagawi, chairman of the Dubai Future Foundation, is to be an incubator for ideas and innovation. This is the first museum that looked to the future. We know the next 50 years, it will be an amazing year for humanity. Education will be disrupted, future of money will be disrupted, economy will be disrupted. Designing a better future for humanity, that's the mission of this museum. And for the museum's visitors, that mission starts with a journey into the future. We are going to 2071, 50 years on the road, to the International Space Station. Here we go. Come on, folks. Come for the ride. Experiencing what life could be like in a huge space station 50 years from now, visitors get to role-play their own story in space. We're docking, folks. Nobody needs to know how old we are now that we've arrived 50 years into the future, right? You'll be younger. <laughs> and in the vault of life, a chance to do their bit to save potentially endangered species. Jetpacks, robot dogs and bionic limbs. The exhibits in this seven-story museum seem straight out of a science fiction film. But this innovation, Gawi insists, is at the core of this technology-focused economy. Look at Dubai, look at the United Arab Emirates as a big lab. Maybe the concentration of this lab as, is the museum of the future. But the whole nation is a lab designing a better future. In some ways, Gagawi says, the museum is a statement of the country's intent. Born out of the words of Dubai's leader, inscribed in Arabic calligraphy on the building's glistening skin, the future belongs to those who imagine it, design it, and execute it. It isn't something you await, but rather create. <laughs>